December 23, Wednesday. It's taken from Isaiah 53, 1-9. Because your love is better than life, my lips will glorify you. No glitz, just glory. Looking at the handmade Christmas ornaments, my son, Savior, crafted over the years in the annual mismatched bubbles Grandma had sent him. I couldn't figure out why I was not content with our decorations. I'd always valued the creativity and memories each ornament represented. So, why did the allure of the retail stores, holidays, displays tempt me to desire a tree adorned with perfectly matched bulbs, shimmering orbs, and satin ribbons? As I began to turn away from our humble decor, I glimpsed a red, heart-shaped ornament with a simple phrase, with a simple phrase scripted on it. Jesus, my Savior. How could I have forgotten that my family and my hope in Christ are the reasons I love celebrating Christmas? Our simple tree looked nothing like the trees in the storefronts, but the love behind every decoration made made it beautiful. Like our modest tree, the Messiah didn't meet the world's expectations in any way. Jesus was despised and rejected. Yet, in an amazing display of love, He still chose to be pierced for our transgressions. He endured punishment so we could enjoy peace. Nothing is more beautiful than that. With renewed gratitude for our imperfect decorations and our perfect Savior, I stopped longing for glitz and praised God for His glorious love. Sparkling adornments could never match the beauty of His sacrificial gift. Jesus. So, how can you make praising Jesus part of your Christmas celebration? What does His sacrifice on the cross mean to you? Loving God, please help me see the beautiful love reflected through the, magn through the magnitude of your sacrifice. So yun na, guys, for me is uh, celebrating Christmas is not about uh, giving and receiving gifts and or having a shimmering Christmas lights, Christmas tree, or kahit ano pang buong mag... Alamin natin kung ano talaga yung tunay na kahulugan na kung bakit sinaselebrate. Let's go over here.